Hello everyone, we're heading into the Ferris Master Crown Trial, we're doing the level 4 hard version. Uh, we are limited to Final Fantasy V only units for this. And the missions are no continues, no death, and 5 turns. So we're going in with a budget team, and we're going to see if we can get all missions with it. So up first we have Galoof, he is here to be our tank. So we did give him some defense, some health and stuff. Everything's easy, cheap gear. And we did give him Winged Heart, just he's immune to everything there. Uh, Gilgamesh, we're starting him off in the shift, and main thing is we just gave him a water element weapon, and that's about it. Then we have Ferris. Ferris doesn't really matter, I'm just using my uh, event team. But we just need a unit with Blue Wave. Just need a Janner there. Uh, X-Death is going to do pretty much all the damage. So we got him set up for Meteor as cheaply as I could go. So the most expensive thing is the Helm from Clash of Wills with the Chain Cap on it. And we just got him some Killers, some Mana. Use the cheapest Mana card, which is the 4th Anniversary. There are way better ones that, if you have, use instead. And we do have all Mana Rolls on the Onion Knight. And that's about it for him. We have 300 on his Aquatic Killer. And Bart. So Bart starts off in the shift for auto LB fill. He's going to buffer us, essentially. So, no real gear for him. He's just our buffer. Alright, let's jump into this. Alright, Bartz is going to shift and limit first. That'll give us Wind and Bew and 280 buffs. Galoof can go next. So we're going to use his cooldown physical cover. We're going to do his mitigation. And then we'll just hit his provoke there. Gilgamesh. We're going to do 85 breaks. We're going to imperil all the elements. And then he can get some mana back because whatever. Uh, Ferris isn't really doing anything this turn. And X-Death. So we are going to just single cast Complete Void, and that way we get a 130 Wind and Peril this turn. Alright, so Bart's. We're going to do his cooldown. Which will just give 45 wind boost to everybody, mainly X Death. So X Death is going to Meteor. Gilgamesh is just going to triple on his bolting. Ferris is just going to Blue Wave. And let's chain it up. Okay, didn't quite kill it, but that is perfectly fine. We went kind of weak on x death, which is fine. We can use items. We're just going to Elixir him. And we'll finish it next turn. Alright, so we'll do the same thing. So, Meteor with x death, Triple Bolting. And a Blue Wave. So obviously building x death a little bit better. We'd kill it a turn sooner. I just went as weak as I could go. So Oliveira's card's definitely better. Could probably do it on that first attack turn there. If you get the Demoness card, even better. So x death did all the damage. Varus, like I said, was just Blue Wave Chainer. Didn't really matter there. Gilgamesh was our breaker in Imperil. Well, Imperil for the water so that we could properly uh, elemental chain there. And that's all our missions. So we're going to end this video here. Hope everybody enjoyed.